All right, and actually, uh, I should have mentioned this in the previous tutorial, the email does still come through in the inbox of uh, the intended recipient. So there it is right there, uh, exact same phrase, and it shows up in both inboxes. Um, however, on this topic, what we're going to do is I'm going to show you the interesting little feature that, uh, that some utilities out there have, such as Yahoo and Gmail, uh, but the problem is they're a little bit less secure uh, this is what you have in Zimbra is an IM client. You have an instant messaging client. You click here to log in and then you can set that in your preferences later to automatically log in by default. So uh, go ahead and click here to add a, a user or add a buddy. We could call this Fred. And you can set up groups uh, later on however you see fit. And on my other screen here, like I said I'm not going to bother to log out and show you and you'll see it here pop up in the lower right here in a second I have a, a window that popped up in the lower right that said demonstration at Bear Consult wants to add you as a buddy accept and I have the option to accept and add accept or deny so I'm gonna say accept and add and you'll see it pop up in the lower screen there Fred wants to add you as a buddy accept yes accept so now I can see Fred's status uh, for example over here I'm gonna turn him by doing by clicking on this here are your different statuses that you could use uh, or you could create your own by clicking on that on the other machine here I'm gonna click do not disturb and just like that Fred switches to do not disturb you got a little pop-up up here and you can see it on the icon here so I'm gonna go ahead and set him back to online and uh, have him email me so And just like that, instant message. And you can even see when they're typing up there. So that's how you use the instant messaging client. This is great if not everyone uh, is in your office, for example. If you're out in, in the field or you have employees that are out in the field, they can be logged into their Zimber account as long as they have an internet connection. That's another great thing about it is you can log into this anywhere that you have an internet connection. You can log in in China. You can log in in Russia. You can log in at your neighbors. It doesn't matter. As long as there's someone there uh, that has an internet connection, you'll be just fine. Um, so that's how you use the instant messaging program, and uh, yeah, it's, it's basically the same as any other instant messaging program, but this is internal server, so it has to be um, anyone that's on the server. For example, the Bear Consult domain is on the same server, so that can be shared with your domain, for example. So if I'm online, um, then you can add me as a buddy, and I can add you as a buddy, and we can talk, uh, and that's, that's another great feature of Zimbra.